Hey guys, it's Fnat Guide, and let's say you want to use a secondary monitor. You've placed it to either the right or to the left of your main monitor, and you've already put it into the plugged the HDMI port in because you have to do that, and HDMI is basically what everyone's using now. You've done that, but you don't really know how to do everything else. So we're going to cover that in this video right now. So, if you're here and you don't really know how to plug it in, you have to find a free HDMI port on the back of your computer. That's what you have to do for a secondary monitor. Then, to set it up, go into your settings go to system then go to not that I'm just checking to see which one's which I already know which one's which so you'll go to detect I've already done that so yeah you'll do that to detect another display and then it will ask you about mul the multiple displays. As for the multiple displays, I have two of them. You can either show only on the main display, have it show only on the main display. The secondary one will go to sleep or sleep or whatever whatever you want to call it. You can have it show only on the secondary display. The primary display will turn off. And or you can duplicate these displays so that it'll show on both. It kind of looks weird, but For work, he'll do this thing. And you can extend the displays, which I have right now. And with all that settings change, with all those settings changes, my screen recorder actually moved around a lot because. The display it was on turned off. And I, I usually use it on a secondary display anyway to record this display. And you can change either display's resolution. Do that. The color profile. You can change the size of the text and whatnot. You can change the resolution. This is the maximum resolution. Or it's the screen resolution anyway. The screens I have are two different resolutions. The one I have plugged in is like a decade old. So, it's not up to the today's standards. And so, yeah. For also the multiple displays, you can choose which one's the main display. I have 
the one that's recorded on right now, this one, to be made to be the main display. Then you can also connect this to a wireless display. I don't have a wireless display with me right now, so I can't demonstrate that. You also have advanced display graphic display settings. And that's for both. And so yeah. For that anyway, graphic settings. I have OBS in there because I got the black screen. I know that's been a problem for some of you out there. It'll be the same no matter which display you choose. It's for the computer, not for the display. It'll be the same no matter which display you choose. That's what I said earlier. And so, yeah. I also forgot that, that you can change the brightness. That's basically on every display nowadays. And also a blue light filter. I'm not sure if it's on my other display, the secondary one, because it's over a decade old. And so, yeah. Please make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.